This is a quick update on how I'm using Sansama and the one thing I wish I could do with it. So this is what I see when I open up Sansama and I'm really only using this with two or three apps. I know many people are plugging in all of their project management apps. I was doing that before, but I've actually simplified this um, because I'm somebody that is like addicted to using email for task management and I'm really trying to get away from that. So what I have here is Gmail, my calendar. I do have my PM tools in here, but I'm really not using them um, with my current workflow. So what I'm doing is I'm basically taking everything from my inbox that I need to action and I'm dragging it over to today. So today's Thursday. I'm just gonna drag in everything I know that I need to do. And then anything that, this is just like a quick newsletter, I'm just deleting it because I don't want to go into email. So I would go through all of these. If I need to action this, like maybe I want to read this later, I would move it over, but I don't need to read this. That's a duplicate. And so we can go on and on here. I know this is just an update. This is something that I need to do. This is a lead. And we'll continue going through here. This I want to read, but see, I'm not, adding timing or anything here. This is something I want to read. So I'll continue to go through all of these. And then I think I'm doing this a little bit backwards, but I will plan the day after I drop the tasks in from Gmail. So now that I moved over all of my calendar items and Gmail tasks into today, I'm going to start planning. So I'm just gonna hit P for planning. And here are all of the things on my list for today. It's obviously way too many. So I know, you know, this is later. Um, I'll start sort of just either logging in and reading these or rearranging them. And then I'm gonna look for anything that I can move over um, to the following week. So here I'm in, you know, what can wait? What do I absolutely not need to do today? And the way that I work, I'm a freelancer, I am alone, so I don't have employees. I sometimes have contractors, but the majority of my work is just done by me. So these are all action items that I need to complete. So I have to be really careful about what I do um, because my day obviously gets packed really quickly and there are a lot of projects that are short for me, so just things that I need to quickly do, send somebody a file or update an asset, something that maybe only takes five minutes. So I will have a huge list for the day um, versus you know a big project that is sliced up into chunks. So I have a lot of little things. So I'm gonna go in here and see just what I can do tomorrow. So I can sign this tomorrow. I can do this one tomorrow, and I'll continue to go down. This is just something that I wanna watch. Um, this I need to reply to. And then these things are things I can do next week, and it's just gonna help me clear out today's schedule. And that's something that I wanna read. Okay, so I've taken out some items, but I still have all of this in here, and I'm just gonna quickly um, estimate how long I think these will take. I'm gonna move this to tomorrow. And then I can also just move these so I can snooze it so it'll go away and come back um, or I can deal with it. I like to deal with them um, just because I need to see it all and I like to action things and I like to get them off my list. That's just the way that I work. Okay, so here is what I have left and I'm gonna go ahead and close this because I'm done. And here's what's in my list for today. Here's what's in my list for tomorrow, and a lot of these will probably end up getting bumped over to tomorrow, but Sansama will do that for me. 
so this is where I feel like Sansama could be really amazing. Um, at this point, I am almost completely out of Gmail. I read my email inside Sansama. I organize my tasks that arrive via Gmail inside Sansama. But if I need to reply to an email, I have to open up Gmail. So if I'm here and I want to reply to this email, I'm gonna, this is great, I can just open it up. But now I'm back here in my inbox and I'm nine times out of 10, I've got to click over here and just see like, oh, what could I, what could I quickly delete out of here? And I will get stuck again. So Sansama engineers, if you're listening to this, please figure out some magical way to allow us to reply to emails from Gmail inside the app. And then we'll never have to go to Gmail again.